What's up YouTube? Here is my 1966 C10 patina truck. Um, just recently got it finished, running, driving, taking it to a few shows, having a lot of fun with it. But uh, never really made a build video on this, so now I'm just gonna do a little highlight of it, show you what's all been done to it. Um, been building this for about two, two and a half, three years. Six Silverado, uh, 4L60 trans, 2500 salt converter. I did a cam swap, port and polish the heads. It's uh, dynoed at 350 horse, around 320 torque. Um, it's fun to drive, that's for sure. Four core aluminum radiator, and then got Ride Tech control arms. Thor Bros front drop member, rag and pinion steering. Um, let's see what else. Got the switch suspension hood hinges there. Let you run. Uh, no inner fenders, so you can tuck these big 22 inch wheels. And then, let's see, I got the AC compressor set up. Don't have the AC, the vintage air in the truck yet, but pretty soon. made my intake there just kind of a you build it intake kit and then what else that's about it under here we'll uh i'll get in and fire it up for you do a little cold start video and then inside we got had the seat reupholstered Repainted the whole inside. Still got to get my visors in. Dakota digital gauges, forever sharp steering wheel. Um, and then there's the AccuWare controller. Just wanted to keep the inside, you know, factory, pretty much stock looking. But just redo it all. Um, didn't redo the doors yet because I'm not really sure if I'm gonna keep the white look. Everybody says to keep the white, mismatch doors, because it adds to the patina, but I don't know, it just kind of throws it off to me. Alright, sitting in the truck now, I'm going to do a cold start for you. So yeah, that's my 66 C10. Um, if 
you like this video, go ahead, like, subscribe. Um, you can follow me on Instagram. It's Robbie, R-O-B-B-Y underscore V underscore. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching.